Now over to some other disturbing report where a woman in Kayole has now threatened to sue two police officers based at Huruma police station for allegations of violating her rights after they forced her to strip naked to confirm whether she was a woman. The woman who has beards now wants the law to be clear on how the police should treat people with similar challenges. <laughs> Teresia Mumbi is a matatu conductor in Nairobi. She is one among few women who have dared to make a living in the male-dominated field. Mumbi has another uniqueness, albeit genetic. She has beards and at first glance, you may mistake her for a man. Nonetheless, she is proud of her bearded chin. 15th May this year, however, Mumbi says her dignity was violated when two police officers based at Uruma police station forced her to remove her clothes to confirm that she was indeed a woman. Wasichana wawiri wa awa mapolisi walikuja wakaniambia nitoe mguo. Mimi nilitoeshwa mguo. Wakaniambia nipanue mguo. Wakaniambia ni ati ebue ka vizuri tuone vizuri. Sasa wali waliangalia sasa venye waliona sijui venye wali judge nikaambiwa niweke nivae nguo zangu an act she says informed her decision to shave the beards even though they grow after every two days. She says she had chosen to keep her bearded and shaven at the time because they are often itchy after every shave. In a male dominated industry, Mumbi says she expected a police officer will protect her while in the cause of hustling for her son. Sasa kama nyinyi mnanifanya hivi na wenye wako huko nje na wako kwa serikali watanifanya nini Since that day it was 15th nimerudi kazi leo mimi niliokopa kama forces iko na polisi wenye wako mix mbona sisi tunakuwa harassed kitu ya pili mtu ako na complete uniform mpaka na badge tunaulizwa nini yani hii uniform ni kama exhibit ya mimi kushikwa nikikosa kuvaa naitwa mwizi nikivaa mimi ni cash cow Huruma police station has confirmed to have received the complaint of the said abuse, but our efforts to reach Stare or CPD Alice Kemeli for a comment were futile as her phone went and answered the whole day. The privacy, especially the private parts of a person, they are so private that the only person allowed by law to ever move there, to ever have a glance there, is a qualified medical personnel for the single purpose reason, one, that treatment is required. And until Mumbi gets justice, the jury is out there. Cecilia Kesho, KT News.